welcome to our course D11. Actually, I call this bonus D, the seven secret of a phenomenal relationship. Today, we're going to discover skill seven. Live consciously, be the example of what you want in the world. Or you can say reclaiming your identity how to transform your entire family. Welcome to this session, it's called Bonus Day. How are you today? I'm 100% sure you got a phenomenal, secret of the phenomenal relationship. How do you feel after the yesterday session? Do you feel happy? Did you discover what need to change? Did you plan for 90 days what you're going to do? In this session, we're going to discover some new things, new strategy. Are you ready? Now we explore the final master relationship skill. Live consciously, be an example. The skill of being a great example requires the ability to maintain high standard and the strength to uphold your new high standards. It's crucial to remember that any change you make does not end with you. It creates a chain of consequence, an example that will affect generation of those who follow. If you have children, remember that your example will affect them more than almost any other influence in their life. That example in turn will affect their children and so on. What do you think? When you understand the psychology, this big influence on your children because you are role model for your children. Take the responsibility and strength for being fully conscious of the example you set in your life and community. What do you think? Are you ready to set the example? There can be tendency of backsides, I know, come too many come obstacles. Whatever, we make progress in an area of our lives. This often comes from not rewarding and reinforcing yourself for making the change. You should give reward to yourself. You should buy something for yourself. There are also forces in your life that will try to pull you back to playing small. You can combat these tendency by holding yourself to a high standard, remembering the power of consequence and influence. So far, we discover what we need in the relationship open, free, flowing, full of energy. What do you think? Strong, physical presence, love, unconditional love, and opening to love and giving love. What do you think? And you want love, energy, and attention, freedom, appreciation. What do you think? You want this. Every single person want these things in the relationship. And now you know the strategy, you know the formula, how you can create this passion, energy, full of life energy, appreciation, love, let go of the past. You already know the how to do this. What do you feel? What do you feel? Now you can just think about when we start this first day session and now as 11 days, what do you feel? Where, where have you changed most emotionally, personally, in the relationship? What do you think? What's a big change happened in 11 days in your life? I love to hear from you. I love to hear your feedback. We already know that when we create new ways, we have to change our patterns. We need a support. Ask these questions. How will you be different approach 
to help your partner and love your partner. You already wrote it. Now, presence, how you can completely connection, empathy for what the other person is experiencing in this moment. Tough moment, happy moment, you can feel it. But have it or believe could you let go to create more connection with your partner. You already know that. You know this? Say yes. Say yes. I know. When you condition the new behavior, how will you sustain with new behavior? Visualize a better future. Ask your heart what you need to do. Anticipate how new obstacle will be overcome. Ask. You have the power to ask. Just give the metaphors to yourself, make you inspire, joys, new relationship. When you feel, say, no, 90 days, I'm not going to follow this plan. Visualize a better future, better relationship, more love. Think about this. And another exercise you can do with your partner, just look into his eyes, each other, every day. Every day do this exercise. You make this habit. Five minutes, maybe three minutes, look into each other's eyes. Don't say anything. Just look at them. Look into each other's eyes. Make this habit. Maybe nighttime or daytime. And think. Just, you can see. It's a big difference when you do this every day. You can see your communications be change. And you truly presence with your partner I think I would like to share with more rules we can say the rules or I can give you the more simple points I love to share with you this really help you to create intimacy love in your relationship and it's help you overcome challenge hurdles in the relationship and a way to distrust and you will trust your partner. Steps for creating intimacy with your partner. Honest about needs and desire. Be honest. What you really need in the relationship. Think about is your relationship just only about yourself or your need are my needs. You have to think about your hair giver or your hair taker or maybe you think just only focus is both on meeting your needs as well as your partner you believe as that I will take care of myself you will take care of yourself and we will try take care of each other if I can't meet your needs however I'm out of the relationship you're playing at him you have to think about where be honest with your need or you your need are my need in a stage as a three relationship you take total responsibility for how the other person feels you will not stop or giving up for any reasons until you meet your partner's need this is a three level relationship this is called unconditional love Do you remember that we discover in this point now you have to decide where are you right now I'm 100% sure you are in the conditional love level right you just meet your partner's need and I think never give up full present committed to make your partner feel your love connection deep connection give significance love I'm repeating again look each other's eyes and feel feel look each other's eyes and feel don't speak just look into her eyes his eyes just be with her look into her eyes just this only every day do this exercise and tell me how your life had changed this exercise so very simple so very powerful and feel grateful for your partner 
Now, I think you already know you're really grateful for your partner. Open up each other's. Write the text each other. Write the letter each other. And this is the rules. Don't correct your partner. Just listen them. Listen this. Listen them. Listen your partner's problem. Don't give them advice. Listen them. After, if they ask advice, then give the advice. And never compare your relationship to others. Never compare your relationship with others. Okay, when you have the conflict situation, how you do handle this? You already know that. Stay calm. Don't blame. Don't criticize. Don't use abusive language. Don't bring up the past. Don't try to be right as superior. You want to win the win the argument or you win the relationship. Okay, now we already discovered in the skill change the word, change the feeling. Maybe if you're frustrated, unhappy, think about what's a message behind this. Think about. Follow these rules. Don't get stale. Don't get old. Just do the same thing when you're beginning the relationship. You remember how you meet your needs, your partners, how you create excitement, how you create surprise. Do the same thing. Don't think, I'm get old, I won't do this. Don't do this. And just go innovations. How you can meet needs new way innovation in your relationship same when a business company do smart marketing in order to get potential clients to want to the business with them likewise they use innovation to find a way to meet the need of the customer better than anyone else you can use the same strategy in the relationship what do you think find the new way relationship putting best face attention potential innovated spending time thinking about that person would like and how to make them happier they they have never happy they never feel special is your partner your number one fan do you know that how to do this you already know that you know this Valentine day might over but passion in your relationship should be an ongoing adventure a sex excitement partnership take focus and dedication to create and it will light up every part of your life are you are you planning to this bring more excitement in your relationship every day valentine for you every day valentine for you by focusing on creating a raving fan culture at home you can put yourself into the positive loving and relationship focused mindset that is a necessary to build a strong commitment skewed relationship partnership this is one of the great gifts you can give to your partner and to yourself because your partner will a ton your soulmate and the relationship will enter a positive cycle that allows you born in strength and grow exceed expectations it's easy to get lazy in a relationship to grow I know she says okay leave it I got married leave it no creating a raving fan culture in home try home means always giving more than your partner would accept expect would expect whether there is a chance to get the extra mile surprise delight your partner they will surprise in kind of loyalty and unconditional love recognize your partner's need you already know that recognize and meet your partner's emotional need what he or she really needed what's important to her you already know that 
trust and feeling to true love. Make it a point to discover what your partner love language. Ask her what she need in her life to feel loved. Ask him her what he or she need you to or say even the attempt of having this conversation will help you start a better understand your partner in inner world inner world what do you think how's your relationship like if you use these points rules in your in your relationship how you feel your partner feel more safe more secure in your relationship more certainty reward your partner what's a missing in the relationship we hardly appreciate them we hardly give them surprise we say okay he's mine now no being in a serious relationship with someone doesn't mean you get stop dating them planning dates for your partner for even surprise him or her will help you keep the spark and excitement alive what do you think just plan go date again let your partner know that you like having her around let your partner know that you like having her around tell your partner how lucky you feel to be with him or her share with her and what she bring to your life compliment him or her notice her let your partner not know that he is a priority for you your partner deserve to be your number one priority and that including receiving communication love communication what do you think constantly constantly improving bring new ideas When you have any disagreement and argument, you know how to handle this. You know how to control your state. You already know that. What do you feel this? What do you feel? You must always be striving to improve yourself and find how to effectively meet your partner's need and wants in unique and powerful way. and i love to hear this your unique and powerful way to meet your partner needs i love to share this or to make a plan you can email me you can whatsapp me or to make a plan for your partner to meet his or her needs unique way and powerful way you can share your successful story so and other people can follow you You can tell this I have I have learned this course my life has changed you can use this techniques you can use this unique way powerful way you can share your story tell the people maybe they your role model for you what do you think creating fulfilling relationship you already know discover the way to meet your partner's need what they really need her We already know six human needs. You already know this. What do you think? We already know that each of us has all of these needs, but too many ways you can meet these needs. Okay, you already know the powerful ways. You already know the uniqueness way to meet your partner's need. Now is our summary. each of us all of six of these needs but in a different level meeting just three needs create an addition additions to a person or behavior imagine if you can find a way to meet all six six of your partner's need what do you feel how's your relationship like what level of fulfillment you have what level of passion you have in your relationship what level of freedom you have what do you think your relationship will become a vehicle for deep and meaningful fulfillment what do you think ultimately you will create a relationship where you and your partner are meeting each other's need transforming 
your relationship into the greatest source of pleasure and I just I hope this program for you new start a new level of possibility I have privilege spending time with and I hope some days you will send me notes or video messages how affect this program in your life and I'm really sorry if some words you don't understand it or maybe I said something wrong pronunciation I'm sorry for that I don't know when I'm go in the deep meditations I don't know what I'm saying I go just on a different state I'm too much involved what how, I don't know how can I make it better and better and this program if really some points you disagree with this I'm really sorry for this I try my best give you the best strategy best point best affirmation because I always work with best people as a reason I always try to give best service to everyone because when you work with best people your first priority provide the best service to them I hope some days you will send me notes or video messages how affect this program in your life I hope I touch your heart and impact your destiny this is my life about thank you for that privilege and pleasure make sure your life masterpiece and your relationship masterpiece and you have a phenomenal relationship we're going to see soon and another thing I love to say this if you really want to use your mind power you want how she use your affirmation power how you use your subconscious mind power you can join our 90 days coaching program and this coaching program you get support every day every day you get emotional mentally sport strategy powerful techniques every day every different method to meditations how you create abundance love wealth success how you create your dream life how you create your destiny with this you already have this power in your in your body but unfortunately it is sleeping if you really want to activate this power you can join our coaching program and again thank you thank you for that privilege and pleasure make your life masterpiece thank you for the privilege Thanks for that privilege and please make sure your life masterpiece. Good luck. God send you lots of love, lots of success, wealth and peace. This is always prayer for you. Thank you very much. Thank you.